Hi everyone, I'm here with a Dollar Tree haul. This is like three trips to the Dollar Tree. So it's kind of it. I, I found these cute gnomes on these garden stakes. And I may or may not use these in my yard. I may just cut them off because I'm trying to work on, I'm trying to make me a tear tray. I've never had one. So um, I may cut the stems off and use these for that purpose. And they are so cute, so patriotic. So I got those. And then I picked up this cute little one with the, um, the beetle car. Welcome, friends. <laughs> Super cute. Love it. You only have one of those. And then I found a few of these with the bees. I thought these would be not only cute in the yard, but to clip off and use on some crappy projects. And I've got a couple more of these the gnomes, I guess, in case I do want to put a couple in my yard. And this was a two pack and yeah two yard sticks and they're they made out of like um i don't know it looks like paper but it's kind of like thin paper and that one and then this one usa oh they're super cute so i'm gonna use those in my yard and then i found this cute nomi sign that says summer <laughs> These little gnomes are so cute with their sunshades. This one's <laughs> so adorable. This one's gonna go scuba diving. Love it. I'm gonna put that. I don't like the glitter because the glitter does come off, but I'll make do. It was cute next to Nomi, so I had, just had to. Then I picked up some of these bamboo skewers. And I have already used these on the grill. And I also picked up this Parmesan cheese container. What I thought I would do is to put wood bees in there and use them to paint, like stand them up. That's my theory. I'm hoping it's gonna work because I get these wood bees. Let me show you real quick. I get this big bag of wood bees from Amazon. It's like 500 wood bees in here. And I thought that would be a good way to paint them. So that's what I'm gonna use those for. And then I picked up some felt in black, purple, or lavender, red. And then they had, there was my candle. Then they had these beautiful little fabrics. Love these. I really love this green and this blue, it's so cute. I did pick up a yellow one. Let me show you what I made with that. I made some fabric flowers, and that's one using the Dollar Tree fabric. These were from Walmart. But I thought he turned out so cute. So that was one like this, like tie-dye, but it was yellow. So that's what I did with that. And then I picked up these cake trays. I thought I would um, use these on the bottom, on the very bottom for feet. And then make me a tear tray out of that with a candle. That just went flying. Table. But anyway, this is the candle that I want to use in the middle of and stack them and then paint it white. We'll see how that goes. If it works out, I will come back and show you. Okay. Picked up some of these dice, foam dice, and I'm going to use these for some crafty projects. I'm not going to use those for toys. I will come back and show you that if it works out as well. Found these letter tiles. And these go so quick, the cashier said that they can't keep them in stock. And he was right, because when I went back, they had none. I should have picked up more. They had tons of them when I first went in there. But I only picked up two, but in order to make, spell out words, I guess you would need more than, more than one or two packs, depending on what you had to spell. Oh, here's the pink, is that pretty? The fabric. Then I found some napkins. Beautiful. I thought these would be really good to use for decoupaging. It's all about the zoning. Love that. I love these with the flowers. I love this one. It says Sweet Summer. I thought these would be really cute to use also. And then I have already used this one. It says Be Positive. And I will show you what I did with that. I mod posh it on this smashed can. And, and that's the napkin. How adorable is that? 
turned out so cute. And that's going to be in my bee collaboration video. If you haven't watched that, go check for that. You'll see what else I made. And let's see. Okay, I got some wood nautical icons. Pick up the ones I thought I would use. One of these sea horses. And this is the whale. And this one is the um, turtles. I thought those would be really cute to use in crafting. And then I found these. Thought these were awesome. You probably can decoupage these too. Um, these are. Does it say? Well, they're sand dollars, but it doesn't say what they're made out of. They're kind of heavy. And then these are the starfish. Oh, I thought these were so cute to use in crafty projects. Okay. And I picked up this metal garden hook just to hang some bird feeders from the trees in my yard. Oh, more dice. There's the glue. And then I found these sponge dollars. Love using these. I picked up these four mini hats in the 4th of July theme. And then I found these out by the cash register. And I thought these were so pretty. You can send these in friend mail or put some money in here for a teenager. How adorable. And I picked up one in each color. These are so blingy and so flashy. So cute. And I picked up this for some cotton balls or I might use it in a crafty project. Picked up this to make some fabric flowers like I just showed and, and put them on this, put them in this vase. Maybe put a bow around it to be pretty. I found these when I was walking in the door and I thought these were so cute so I had to pick up one of each. It is so adorable. I want to say he's a sloth, hedgehog, frog, and the fox. The fox was so adorable I had to pick up two. And they turn on. They're bright. I, I don't know if I will use this in my yard or not, but I'm probably going to use these for decorations in my office, at work, or either at home. And then I picked up some of these clipboards. I got one in the black, two in the white, and two in this were pretty um, natural color. I thought those would be cute to craft with. And I found some of these terracotta pots that I'm going to use for crafty projects and hopefully they're not broken and won't break. Different sizes. And then I picked up this and the wood. I'm going to find my paint that I use that in a crafty project. And this. And then I picked up two of the crates. And I found these. I found two when I went. They had tons of them. And I went back and I picked up two more. I love these. These would be good to paint and use on crafty projects like cards or ATC cards. And I found some of this. Some I used on some crafty projects. And then I found some of the nautical rope. Only found this one color. It had a lighter color and I didn't pick that up. Picked up these. Thought these would be cute for decorations at work or in my craft room. Picked up some black pom poms. Picked up a sewing thread kit. I was making those fabric flowers like I just showed. Picked up two things of stamps. So these would be so cute to use on crafty projects too. Those are so beautiful. I picked up some of this jute twine in green and then the uh, natural color. Picked up a three. Of, yeah, picked up those. And then I found some flowers. Oh, these are real pretty to use. Lilac to use in crafty projects. Um, and I found some sunflowers, but this one, yeah, that's Dollar Tree. Baby's Breath. And then this one. This is Baby's Breath, but it's pink, so I don't know. And then I picked up this one, the daisy bush. It was $3, but this was at the, the store that was also a family dollar, Dollar Tree combined store. And let me show you what I made with that. I used those in my can, smash can, the pink daisies. And I also made this cute gnome using the pink daisies. 
Hey, super cute. So that is my haul. That is everything I picked up from Dollar Tree. Um, probably will be going back very soon again. I just love that store. So thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye for now.